Last night, the Stockton Heat extended their point streak to seven games on the season following the 3-2 shootout loss to Tucson inside the Tucson Convention Center. Hi, everyone. I'm Chris Pichet setting up the game day report from Tucson, Arizona. The Stockton Heat in the loss last night. They did extend that point streak to seven games and now through six contests to start the 2019-2020 season on the road. Stockton has a record of 5-0-0-1, so points in all six of their road games. And something that has plagued Stockton over the last couple of weeks has been minor penalties. They had to work on the penalty kill seven times last night, and that is first and foremost what this group is trying to clean up ahead of tonight's game. Yeah, definitely. Uh, we, uh, we know we can't be doing that. Uh, every night like we have been the last few games so uh, it's been a big emphasis for us and I uh, just try to clean up so that we don't have to kill seven eight times a game and uh, I mean we're kind of hanging him out to dry there in those situations too so I mean he's been good Johnny's been good I mean Zeg uh, has been good as well but last night especially uh, Johnny held us in that one uh, we work early uh, I think we're where we're where we're in the game and uh, we control the control what happened there mostly but then uh, then we start to taking them too much penalties and uh, they got a little bit of momentum on that and uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. The Tucson Roadrunners are a fast group and a lot of times matching speed with speed is a helpful counteract for Stockton and Glenn Godden has points in his first two games against the Roadrunners this season including a goal last night, his third of the year and tenth point of the season. Yeah, it felt nice. Uh, I think my game's uh, a lot better than what it was last year, so I'm um, trying to continue to comp uh, improve and uh, I mean try to I mean continue to help the team win. Go. They're, they like to play high high pace game and go into offense a lot, so we have to we have to handle box handle box pair and keep the pucks in their zone, so they they can create the create the momentum going our end. And I think that's the biggest thing. Just keep 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 them away from the puck and. Uh, uh, handle the buck a little bit better than in our own, own end. Stockton has the upper hand on Tucson as far as win percentage is concerned, but Tucson playing 12 games to just Stockton's 11. So Stockton just a point back of Tucson for the top spot in the Pacific Division. They'll try and take that top spot back here tonight in Tucson. Puck drop is scheduled for just after 7 o'clock locally, 6 o'clock Pacific Standard Time. You can catch all of tonight's action on AHL TV. And for Heat TV, I'm Chris Pichet.